What's up, everybody? We are back with another season of Neighborhood Spotlights. Mark, we are finally, we are doing what we were supposed to do with this show all along. So, as we talked about earlier, right, this is what we strived to do years ago, mm -hmm. but then the world shut down, and now we, uh, we're back and we're going to do it the right way. So, yeah. this is all about allowing the businesses to shine. This is all about just really getting into the businesses, talking to the owners, seeing what they do, seeing what makes them successful. Yep. And now we're able to do it on location, not virtually behind a screen. Who wants to be behind a screen? It's, I'm done with it. Done with masks, done with screens. Done with it. And we're here. Done with it. And we're live. And we should talk about what it, so, so for those of you who have never seen the show before, Mark and I said, we have to do something for the community. We have to do something for the businesses. Yep. We've got to find a way to use our best skills, which is our personalities and the people we know to shine a light on the businesses that make up the communities we serve. Your best skills are your looks, clearly. Oh, absolutely. Is, is it a skill? Is a look a skill? I don't know, but, but your best asset is your yeah. not your personality. It's your, you know, your, your, your ravishing good looks. But aside yeah. from that, your personality is pretty darn good, too, buddy. So anyway, just had to share that. You look good I today. I just want to tell you, you look good. You look, you look really good. Good? Yeah. Svelte? Yeah. Svelte. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> Is that Yiddish? What is that? Uh, you know, it's a good question. I don't know. I'm, I'm my For baby. those of you that are tuning in, <laughs> let me know what svelte means. A couple people have used that, and I'll take it. I think it, I think it means lean, and it's probably because I'm squeezing into this shirt. This is an extra large. I'm a 2X, but for the show, I wanted to make sure I have my Ice House stuff on. So we are rocking it. We are here in Newtown. We are going to talk. So before we do that and we introduce where we are, sure. talk to everyone about what's been going on with Opus. The neighborhoods we're going to start to get into more. Sure. Just give them a little preview. It's been a while. So it's crazy, right? So Opus started um, just prior to the pandemic. And we mm. had, I think we started with about eight agents in the one location here on State Street in Newtown. Mm. And uh, we're very blessed. We've grown um, exponentially. We're at about 85, 90 agents now. We have four locations. Unbelievable. And ultimately, we want to make sure that we are at, you know, servicing the communities that we work in. Right. And that's kind of what we, we strive to do at Opus. So now we have our Pocono office. We have mm -hmm. our Newtown office. We have mm -hmm. a Bristol office and we have a Robbinsville, New Jersey. Is office. Bristol open? Bristol is officially open. open as of, I think, about three days ago, depending when this airs. Um, yeah, about a week awesome. ago. Um, but yeah, so awesome. we are open up and running for business. And um, so we ideally want to focus on those businesses. Mm. But that being said, if you're a local business owner and you need some exposure, we're happy. And we have yep. a, we're fortunate enough to have a pretty large audience at this point. We've been yep. doing this stuff for, for years. It doesn't yep. seem like it because COVID yep. you know, made it seem like it wasn't. But yep. um, we've had numerous episodes allowing the local businesses to shine, mm -hmm. you know, and, and giving back to the community that we, you're a small business owner yourself, yep. Yep. it's difficult. This is our way of being able to give back our little microcosm here. And that's what we're trying to do. And that's the core value of Opus Elite, right? And that's yeah. why, I, you know, Mark and I have become friends and partners yeah. over a couple of years now. It's kind yeah. of crazy when you yeah. think about it. And the core of, of everything we do is community focused. Thousand percent. And that's why Neighborhood Spotlights is really a passion project yeah. for you and I. I'm excited, and I, I don't want to, you because know, listen, you guys know how it was that tuned into the last season, and uh, we tend to talk a lot. We do want to bring <laughs> our guests on. This isn't about us. This is about the community. This